it's it's an exciting one today. Today I am actually taking the van out on a little test run. Right now I'm inside of my regular car because I'm going to take a ride up to Dollar General and just pick up a few supplies. Food wise for this, I think I'm going to stay a couple of nights. Food wise, I'm just going to keep things really simple, not do a lot of cooking. It's raining out, so I think this will give me an opportunity to be able to see if there's any leaks inside the van, to see how Duders does sleeping in the van and driving in the van, etc. First trip, Duders. Are you ready? Are you excited? <laughs> well, we got everything all kind of packed up here, and this is going to be a weekend of sorting and organizing. So let's go find our camp spot, right? Let's go find a camp spot. We finally arrived. Oh, long story. The first two places did not pan out. The third place, this looks pretty good. Just don't know if I'm gonna be able to back out in the morning. Um, but I'm in a state forest. Probably about 40 minutes from my house. And it's raining. We're underneath a ton of tree cover so it's not that wet outside but you can hear the rain on the roof. Duders did really well. You can see he's down here kind of. I, I moved his co-pilot seat down here. <laughs> he uh, actually went to the bathroom outside like the big boys do and so now I'm going to spend a few minutes just trying to assess the situation, get some lights going. I am starving, the dog needs to be fed, and I only saw one other group of people camping about a half a mile down the road. There are some roads, there's a little path in here I could take for a walk, if it's not raining. <sighs> All right, I will check in a little bit later after I take care of some things around here. snap time. I don't know if there's any room for me on the bed now. <sighs> I, I don't even know what to do right now because it's raining out and I have no I have no bars of internet. So I can't even text the people that need to know that I left. <laughs> I can't even text them to tell them I'm safe. So I may have to walk out a little bit and see if I can get some bars of coverage. So things that you learn, check out the coverage ahead of time. I'm learning a lot. See, I'm learning a lot. This, 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 is, this is why this is a test trip. <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out what I'm going to do to cook because the burner I have is an actually, it's actually a butane burner and I don't think it can connect to propane. So the other option is I have a grill that connects to propane and I have the little propane tanks, but the problem is, is that it's raining out and I don't want to light that in here. I do have this jet boil that I can use and I can use my mini... I can use this one too. I'm just trying to decide which one I want to use. So for now, I literally just ate some Fritos. So I guess I'm just going to snack right now because I figured maybe if it lets up, I'll take the grill out, cook outside. And it looks like it's dark because, well, it doesn't look like it's dark out here, but inside here, because there's no windows, if I turn off the lights, it'll look like it's dark. <laughs> I'm just trying to think of what I can do. There's lots I can do. I just 
I've been driving for like, for what was supposed to be like a half an hour, 45 minute drive. Like I was driving for almost two hours trying to find a location to camp at for tonight. So for my first like official outing as a camper van, this is my first one. And this is my first trip in a state forest, like boondocking, no electric, no water. I just have my battery power, exciting stuff. My little, this is my little forest I'm in. This is a little trail. It's literally, I just stopped driving. So maybe I'll investigate that in the morning if it's not raining. This is where I'm pulled in. It's called Frank's Fancy. But look at all that, those lakes, those mud holes. I hope, I'm hoping I got into a good spot. So I can just back out and pull out there in the morning. It is pouring. I need to get inside. This is what I came up with to eat. We have hot dogs. Hot dogs and cheese that I just like heated up by boiling them. And ramen noodles. <laughs> oh, and I have my iced coffee left over from this morning. Still got ice in it. So I'm just gonna sit here, eat, and then I think I'm gonna edit a video it's literally 10 up 7, and it feels like it's 10 o'clock at night. I think Duders is getting used to it. Right now, he's doing his traditional begging. I put his food down here. You gonna eat your food, Duders? Huh? You gonna eat your food? Or do you want my food? Oh, and the other thing is, I'm enjoying it sitting at my table that works brilliant so happy with it i'm starting to make a list of things that i have forgotten i forgot an umbrella i need i'm gonna need to get something to make like a little canopy so that i can make it easier for me to go outside so maybe like a couple of tarps and poles what else did i forget oh i forgot silverware so i'm using plastic silverware that i had shoved in from like to go orders and stuff i had a bunch of it so, you know, wrapped in these with a little napkin. So I'm using those. What else did I forget? Oh, and the butane. I just hope I can get out. <laughs> or I'm gonna be calling AAA for a tow. <laughs> That'll be a first. <laughs> This is the only movie I have on this laptop <laughs> is Legally Blonde the Musical. <laughs> so this is my post-dinner entertainment. Duders is not impressed at all. I think he likes the bed though. Good morning. I survived my first night. I gotta wake up. Slept pretty good in the bed. It's a nice day out. Ah, uh, let me show you. So this is kind of what it looks like. There is a fire pit here. I literally parked like really close to it because I knew I wasn't gonna use the fire pit. There's a trail. I don't know where that leads to. And this is like the main road. So I'm like literally, I'm not hidden. Like I'm right off the main road. So that's not the main road. That is a dirt road off the main road, I should say. Got my coffee. Now I'm gonna make some breakfast. And I think what I'm gonna do is, I have like a pound of bacon. I'm literally just gonna cook up the whole pound of bacon because I don't, I'm trying to minimize the amount of times that I actually have to like cook bacon. I can always just heat it up tomorrow with the eggs or whatever, so. 
I actually got this set up on this old portable camp stove that I have. I absolutely love, but the top needs to be redone. And the reason why is because a few years ago, I burnt it <laughs> on one of my girls camping weekend trips. I actually like burnt a hole, but it still works. Now that the bacon is all cooked, a ton of bacon, I have three eggs that I'm just gonna scramble now because Duders always eats one egg. So I'm literally just gonna scramble some eggs, put Duders egg aside, and put a little everything but the bagel seasoning on mine. There's your egg. Maybe I'll get him to eat his food. And here's my egg. <laughs> These are my cute little... Look, it's got like duders on my plate. <laughs> with a scuba mask on so got my coffee got my food and now time to eat okay That was good. So I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to clean up. And Duders, is, Duders and I, I think, are going to take a little bit of a walk this morning and just explore down this little trail a little bit. Then I'm going to get to doing some organizing and cleaning up inside the camp. I can't believe how dirty the floor is, so I have to sweep the floor and just start putting things away where I want things to go. I mean, I've been doing it a little bit at a time, like I dug out the French press. Now, once I wash it, I know where the French press is gonna go. Stuff like that. <sighs> okay, let's get moving. <laughs> Do you like your camping chair? That's a good boy. Yeah, this is cute little, I guess this is like a snowmobile trail. Just not sure how, I'm not gonna go too far. But I figured we'd check it out. But let Duders go to the bathroom. Move the body a little bit. Just all forest, all forest around me. I didn't bring any wood up to burn because I knew I was just going to be using my grill. Well, it looks like we're not going too far because there's a huge mud, mud patch above, right in front of us here. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> well, that ends that walk. <laughs> Maybe we'll go up the road the other way. <laughs> Let's see, this is where I was afraid when I was coming in here. I didn't want to come in this way because of all this water. So basically like another camper could theoretically come here. It looks like people have been here with like all the firewood. There's like a ton of firewood. It's all wet though. Firewood there. Somebody was having a big bonfire. And these are all like trails and stuff. Oh, there's a frog. Hello, Mr. Toad. I 
saw something down the road. I don't know if I caught it on video. I'll have to check in the edit. Kind of freaked me out. I don't know if it was, if it was black. I don't know if it was a dog. If it was, it was too big for a cat, a bear, or like a panther. <laughs> I don't think, or some type of like a wild cat because I don't think there's, I don't know if there's panthers around here. I don't think so. He doesn't like going through this heavy grass. Come on over here and there's no, there's no grass. I picked up a few sticks just in case I decided to, I wanted to start a fire tonight. I don't think I'm going to, but just in case. There we go. Yeah, it was down this way, but on the other side of the road, whatever that black thing was. So I'm gonna keep an eye out, see if I can spot anything. So I've been just taking care of a few little projects around here today. One of them is this screen that I'll be kind of detailing in a future video, but now I just wanted to put, I have this really cute mason jar holder that has, I don't know if you can see like the changing colors. I picked that up at the Christmas tree shop and I want to use it on display here. So I'm going to take my Mrs. Myers hand soap and pour it into here so that I can be able to use it. And while that's pouring out, I have this double-sided clear tape. Put a little bit of this tape here in the corner and this just peels off like this. I've used it before. I absolutely love this stuff. Uh, I will leave it linked in the description box if you want to check out the brand to bid it, buy it from Amazon. But the Gorilla brand also has their own version of this, which uh, from what I've heard is also pretty good, which you can pick up at like Lowe's or Walmart, that kind of place. I think what I'm going to do, I'll tip the rest of that over later. Let's just get this. Put it down. I had some people walking by here. I haven't seen anybody today. And there was a couple in their dog walked like right, literally right through here. There, that'll be good. Um, they walked right through here, scared the living daylights out of me and scared duders. He started barking a little bit, but he's been just napping. There we go. See? And that'll stay put. That's not going to go anywhere. I can keep it up there while I'm driving if I want, or I can easily take it apart. So now, I think I'm going to leave this sitting for a while on an angle so that it'll finish emptying into there. Finally getting around to heating up this mac and cheese. This is just a... Uh, you'd think I was cooking for an army, but I'm one of those people who just likes to heat up leftovers. This is still frozen. See, I bought it yesterday frozen. So I'm just gonna heat it all the way through. Yeah, I think the hot dogs are done. I'm gonna roll those on the plate so they don't fall. Then we'll just let those chill here. Dooders is watching the perimeter. Good morning, Dooders. Did you have a good night's sleep? Or are you still sleeping? Good morning, everybody. 
Good morning to you, Tutors. I'm talking to YouTube. He has been quiet all weekend. Unless I'm talking. Tutors, <laughs> I'm talking to the camera. See? It's a camera. <laughs> Anyways, I just wanted to say that he's not... <laughs> Tutors, it's just the camera. <laughs> Anyways, I'm packing up, getting ready to head back home. Um, do we like this pajama top? Oh, for fox sake. <laughs> I thought that was funny. Overall, I think it was a pretty successful trip. I have a list of things that I need to pack that I didn't have prepared the first time. It's kind of like a live and learn. Wish I could wake up. I didn't feel like making coffee this morning, so I think I'm gonna stop and grab coffee on my way out of town, find a Dunkin', Starbucks or something, and grab a coffee for the ride home. It's literally only like a 45 minute drive if that. So I am going to end this video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you are not yet subscribed, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, become notified as to when I upload new videos. You guys enjoy the rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time of day it is. And I'm going to chat with you in my next video. Bye guys.